hello everyone so my problem statement is placement cell web application so here let's us move on to see the problem statement here we need to maintain the database of all the student interviews along with the following details such as batch student details course core detail interviews along with their results so let's move on to the folder structure here we in the this is the main index.js file where we are using various npm libraries such as express morgan path as well and we are using sas middleware sas middleware is used to convert the pre-process file take the pre-process file and store it in the normal css it will help in optimizing our code and run the code faster so we are using assets folder to store all the static files such as css images js and scss then there is one folder called config which consists of environment.js which consists of all the credentials of the user along with the production logs this is the log directory which stores the request log from the browser browsers then there is one middleware which is the custom middleware which takes the request from the flash messages and store it in the locals of the response then there is one mongoose.js file which consists of the database connection code then there is we have uses three passport strategy one is passport local strategy to locally authenticate the user another is github OHAT strategy to authenticate the user via google and one is passport github strategy to authenticate the user via github then there is one models folder which consists of all the schemas of the interview result score student and user then let's move on to the routes in the routes there is one index.js file which is the main index.js file which consists of all the sub routes such as students interview jobs and csv there are these are the interviews route students routes csv routes and jobs routes and this is the users route which consists of profile route update sign in sign up create user sign up user sign in user sign out user and authenticate user via sign google and github so these are the routes folder then views folder is used to render the various ejs pages and there is the controller to access the particular action to be performed from the interview students jobs home csv as well as users so this is the controller part then let's move on to the gulf file here in the gulf file what we are doing is gulf is used to compress the asset folder and uh, and add hash to the css js file and images and and reference the css and js js gulf is used to compress the files of the assets and send it to the browser which helps in making our code run faster so this is the this is all the folder structure part let's move on to run our project so we can run it in production as well as in development let's run it it in production mode so here the connection has been established let's move on to the placement cell website here we can log in via google as well as github let's log in via github here we are login via google so here we are able to see the flash message as login successfully this is the carousel i have used in the home page so this is our home page in order to move to the profile of the user this is the profile page and in order to update it we will use we will update the name of the user and in order to add the profile pic we will use this one and in order to update it we will click on update so here the profile has been updated successfully let's go back so we have gone to the back to the home page let's add the student in order to add student we will need to add the details let's add all the details of the student first
so here this student has been added successfully so let's see whether it is added or not yes here this student has been added successfully let's add another student we have added this course as well let's add the student here this student has been added successfully let's see the list of students so here we have added two students in order to view the details we can click on view button here we are able to see we are able to see that this is the student details in order to edit it we click on edit button let's edit the student name and edit his course as well So update student will update the student and here we get one flash message as well so here we are able to see the updated details of the student let's move on to the list of students here we are able to see the updated details as well let's move on to list of interviews here we have haven't yet added any interview so let's add one interview so here we have added another interview so we are able to see the google as an interview in order to schedule interview we will click on schedule interview button and here we have added one student to the interview slot here we have added another student to an interview slot here we have added two students for the google interview in order to update the result we will click on update button so here are the details of the students that has that has been updated so let's move on to see the list all details here we are able to see the two students that has been listed so let's download the report first so we are able to see the two student details along with the interview date as well as interview result so first of all let's move to list of interviews and in order to delete a particular student from the interview slot we will click on delete button it will delete the student let's go on to list of interviews and in order to delete a interview slot we will click on delete interview slot it will delete the interview slot in order to see the list of student we have two student let's delete one student so here we have deleted one student successfully in order to go to the external jobs portal we will click on external job portal link and it will fetch the details of the placement placement job openings from the external job api in order to apply it will redirect it to the jobs website so this is the overall project i hope you like it thank you